Number 11, the position vector r of a particle moving in an xy plane is given by vector r equals to 2 times t to the third minus 5 times t in the i direction plus 6 minus 7 times t to the fourth in the j direction with vector r in meters and t in seconds. In unit vector notation, calculate vector r, vector v, and vector a for t equals to 2 seconds. What is the angle between the positive direction of the x-axis and the line tangent to the particle path at t equal to 2 seconds? Okay, so for letter A, we just have to calculate this vector. So vector R, when the, the clock shows us 2 seconds. So it is R of 2, which is equal to 2 times 2 to the third minus 5 times 2 in the i direction plus 6 minus 7 times 2 to the fourth in the j direction and this is equal to 6 in the i direction minus let's see minus 106 in the j direction don't forget to include the unit which is meters right so meters so this is the answer of letter A. For letter B, we have to calculate vector V, which is the velocity of the particle. So the velocity of the particle is equal to the derivative of the position vector in respect with time. And this is equal to, let's take the derivative of this vector over here. So it is 6 times t squared minus 5 in the i direction minus 28 t to the third in the j direction so we have to this is the vector of for the velocity so the velocity when the clock shows us two seconds is equal to six times two squared minus five in the i direction minus 28 times two to the third in the j direction and this is equal to 19 in the i direction minus 224 in the j direction and the unit of velocity is of course meters per second so this is the answer of letter b for letter c we have to find the vector acceleration which is the derivative of vector velocity in respect with time so you have to take the derivative of this function over here so it is 12 in the uh, 12 t sorry it is 12 t in the i direction minus let's see this is 3 times 8 24 84 t squared in the j direction so this is vector acceleration so the acceleration when t equals to 2 seconds is equal to 12 times 2 in the i direction minus 84 times 2 squared in the j direction and this is equal to 24 in the i direction minus 336 in the j direction in meters per second square so this is the answer of letter c for letter d what is the angle between the positive direction of the x-axis and the line tangent to the particles path at t equals to two seconds so let's imagine that this is a particle's path so let me draw our coordinate system over here so let's say that this is our path so at any point of the path for example over here you know that the the direction of the particle the particle is going to this direction right so this is the path however at this point the particle is going this direction which points to the particle's velocity so the the line tangent to the particle's path is the velocity at that point well, at least it points to the, the direction of the vector velocity at that point. So if we take 
the angle of the velocity when t equals to 2 seconds if we take the angle between vector v and the positive direction uh, of the x-axis we have the answer of letter d so the angle is equal to the tangent to the minus 1 of the y component of the velocity over the x component of the velocity when t equals to 2 so we are using this equation over here so this is equal to the tangent to the minus 1 of minus 224 over 19 and this gives us two different answers it gives us minus 85.2 degrees and plus 94.8 degrees this happens because when you're taking the tangent of an angle there are two different angles with the same answer so let's see for example this is minus 85 so this is minus 25 85.2 and this is plus 94.8 so this angle over here and this angle over here gives us the same tangent so that's why we have two answers and we have to find which one is the correct one the easiest way to choose is just try to draw this vector over here so it is positive in the i direction it is negative in the y direction or the j direction so we can see that this is our vector over here so the angle is minus 85.2 degrees that's the correct answer